Welcome at the Politics Watch, this is CRP. Now, today we're back with more numbers. By now, you should be able to tell I love numbers. Mathematics is the same in every country, every region, matter where you go. 2 plus 2 is 4 in every corner of the world. History isn't the same. Economics isn't the same. Law isn't the same. People twist and turn and add and take off all kind of things, but 2 plus 2 is 4 in every country. So I love numbers. The two deadliest places in Ironman accidents or road fatalities and murders. Now you might be thinking to yourself, accidents. Well, never show sure, no, how even that is linked to the most murderous places in Ironman. You see, I have shown you the data because I realize as an Ironman growing up, I realize uh, narratives more important than facts. I think this is a Western region thing because I see the same thing in Uncle Sam place. Narratives more important than facts. There's like a few things that are just set in stone that people just say, right? And there's like, even though it's not true, it's been said for so long, people just accept it, right? To the point where it's ingrained in our heads. A perfect example, lions are the king of the jungle. Everybody's heard this statement. This is accepted as reality. Lions are not the king of the jungle because lions don't live in the jungle. So another narrative is that St. Catherine, you know, Spanish stone, quote more, quote unquote, tone, Right. are the deadliest place when it comes on to car accidents. The maddest is that taxi man, them, the maddest the drivers, them, right. are so, right. you're most likely to get quote unquote town. Kings on St. Andrew, right. even St. Catherine, you can't that mix. Turns out that's not the case. According to JCF data, the two deadliest divisions in Ironman are St. James and Westmoreland. St. James have 193 murders. Westmoreland have 137. Westmoreland and St. Catherine now tie murders, but Westmoreland has been in second place much longer and they've been murdered since. Right, so you don't know this data, but JC for sure is up to 12 of December. So St. James, number one, Westmoreland, second. Right, the two deadliest divisions in Ironman. But you're not surprised by that. You'd have seen that long time. Right. The only thing you might be surprised by is that Westmoreland managed to reach that level cause. As you can remember, Westmoreland used to have like 11 murders a year. So, while browsing nationwide, I realized that the road safety unit it was to numbers and the amount of road fatalities this year so far. The total figure is 463, which is a staggering amount of people. If you did from road accidents. 463. I remember when telling Mr. Run campaign to say, right, keep it on that 300 or something like so. Well, can we have past 200? I guess when it comes on to road accidents, 200 is the number that is like the equivalent to the 1000 mark right, for murders. Let me say, keep it on that 300. If we go on that 300, then that's a decent year. Listen to this. Western Ironman right, lead road fatalities. Right, area 1 to be precise. Area 1 includes Trelawney, St. James, Hanover, and Westman. Four parishes. Those four parishes responsible for 152 out of the 463 deaths so far this year. You with me? Listen up closely. Number one, St. James, with 48 deaths so far this year. St. James is number one in Ironman division when it comes out to murders, and the number one division when it comes on to road fatalities. Extraordinary, right? But media book ups. You want to know who's second? Westmoreland. With 47. 
St. James is number one for murders and road fatalities. Westmoreland is second for murders and road fatalities. You can't make this up. The same two divisions that top the chart for murders top it. Road fatalities. Both divisions combined to make 95 road fatalities. 95. Remember in the area one of four divisions. But two of them responsible for 95 out of the 152. Area 5, which includes St. Catherine North and South, St. Andrew North and St. Thomas, have a total of 90 wood fatalities. 90. In other words, Moby and Westmoreland have more fatal accidents this year than all of St. Catherine, part of St. Andrew, and all of St. Thomas. Because Area 5 have 90 total and Mobile and Westmoreland have 95 to them. Once again, extraordinary, isn't it? Listen to this. We'll do some checks. The population of St. James is 184,000. The population of Westmoreland is 144,000. The population of St. Catherine is 518,000. More than Westmoreland and St. James combined. St. Andrew's population is 573,000. Let me see the point, may I get that? Westmoreland and St. James have more road fatalities than the whole of St. Catherine. We have half a million people. We're not talking about rate, no. We're not talking about the rate of act. We're talking about amount of deaths. How a parish with 184,000 people a lead road fatalities and a parish with 144,000 second and have more road fatalities combined than the parish with 518,000. Now, they used to say Spanish stone Taxi man them are some of the most deadliest man them on the road uh, in terms of licking them and killing people. But that simply can't be the case. The numbers don't back that up. Half a million, there's simply more people for lick them. That's more people, more cars, more pedestrians, more everything for lick them. St. James and Westmoreland, still a lead. I remember it involved part of St. Andrew, St. Andrew North, which is a big division. I don't know about you, but I find that fascinating. Same two divisions to lead for murders. Lead for road fatalities. No, I don't even have to tell you about Ironman driving. Because they know it gone already. Everybody thinks they're Louis Hamilton. Everybody convinced themselves that they can't teach Michael Schumacher overdrive. It's very rare I get in a vehicle with somebody in Ironman. And get out of the vehicle thinking this person knows the matter. Right. It's real. I mean, I talk about press gas and steer. That's the see, that's what people call driving you now. Press gas and steer. I mean, I talk about that. I mean, actually, no, no, we competently angle a vehicle. Then again, as usual, I probably should add a disclaimer that about bad mind people for them vehicle. Right. Now, you know how we can stop this, right? You know how we can stop. Road fatalities. You see, I hope the road safety unit is listening. We can stop road fatalities by using Darlingism. You know, Shane Darling, right? our favorite CEO, the FLA. You see, his philosophy is if nobody have no gun, then the husband can't get vexed and shot his wife, or right? no man can have no road rage and shot nobody. So, no guns, no shootings. Using Darlingism, this is how we solve road fatalities. Using Darlingism. If nobody have care, then care can't hit anybody. Let me say that one. May I tell you how to solve it using Darlingism? If there are no cars on the road, there can be no car accident. If there's no bikes on the road, there can be no bike accidents. Right? So, Using Darlingism, right. 
Jamaicans need to be stripped of cars. I'm sorry. Hey, don't get vexed with me. Right? This is how Darlingism works. I'm just a student of the philosophy. No, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear about it. I have to go work. I'm going to care for, for the business. And the, the main purpose is to do this. And it's not my fault. People use car wrongfully and people can't drive and man get drunk and let down people. And I don't want to hear it. This is about saving lives. Saving lives come first, right? So, convert to the church of latter day, darlingism, right? And you will be free from any road debts. If nobody not a car, the car can't hit on a body. If nobody on a bike, then the bike can't hit on a body. There you go, problem solved. Using darlingism. If everybody was walking, then problem solved. Road fatalities is no longer a problem. All bike, all car, all truck, all bus confiscated. Right? You can do like a buyback program like Australia. They know the Shane Darling love Australia. Right? So you can do like a buyback program. The government give you money every make a car. No car on the road. Just walk where I go the umbrella. Problem solved. Darling is in. Can solve this. And just like how it will solve you know, the whole gun issue. Nobody on a legal firearm, then nobody can shoot no man, and nobody can shoot nobody on a road rage and all them things. So I know you're probably upset because you want to use a car to go work or leisure. So I know you're probably upset because you want to use a car to go work or you want to go look for career, you want to go look for maybe lean. No matter. Darlingism is clear. If there's no car on the road, there can be no accidents. Same division, they may lead murder. Lead. In the accidents. Five division, St. Catherine North and South, who does St. Catherine that? St. Andrew North and St. Thomas, total 90. West Milan and St. James, right? Together, total 95. So if anybody St. James or West Milan, spooky times. Anyway, Patreon squad, big up on yourself. Yeah, yeah, I don't know, no life. Ultra squad, say circling, bless.